What is happening guys? I do welcome to my channel. It's your boy and I'm back again. Hopefully you guys are doing well and you're healthy. If you're new guys, please make sure you subscribe to my channel and also make sure you like this video as well. If you don't like it, just make sure you hit the bell notification so you know whenever it's a video which is relevant to you. So we've got these rather unique Nike SB Dunks females. These are called the Run The Jewels and Nike SB Dunk High Pink Black. <coughs> Now, firstly, this shoe is bling. It's for ladies that are into colour, into bling. And you can pull that look off as well. And these kind of ladies are like Missy Elliott. Like Missy Elliott, if you don't know who she is, do your research. But she's uh, a very iconic rapper who's, you know, wore very unique out-the-box type of outfits. And I can see certain females that know how to dress. Like, they can wear this and pull it off as well. Um, it's going to be me judge. <sighs> Not even judging, but I guess like taking this in from a male perspective. So my point of view is going to be skewed a little bit and biased. I lift my hand up. It is a nice shoe though. And I would wear this shoe myself. You know, if I had like extremely disposable income whereby I can buy this and buy a matching like jacket as such, then yeah, fair enough. I, I would definitely pull that off. You know, we've seen like uh, Cameron the rapper, um, he, back in, I think, 2005, I think, he wore, like, a, a pink fur, with, like, a matching pink fur head headband, and he wore some pink Timberlands. And Drake recreated that look as well. So there's certain men that can wear pink and pull it off. Now, I think as an everyday type of shoe, for a male, you might probably struggle. But I think as a now and again type of shoe, then why not? I would definitely wear this. I will definitely wear this. And I think I've, there's a lot of pink items available now. A lot of pink jackets, you know. Um, so there's options out there. There's a lot of options. What I do like, though, I do like that 3D crystallized tick on the side as well. And I like how it looks so different. It's got that glossy finish to it, that kind of patent leather. And the grey as well, just the colour is fantastic. And then you've got the hair, which is the pink which is nice and soft as well. And it's a beautiful contrast to the black leather on the tour box, as well as the side. Initially, when I saw this shoe, I was like, oh my God, that looks a little bit. But the more you look at it, the more you appreciate the shoe. It's different, it's unique, and it's for collectors. If you're not a collector of Dunks or SBs, you will not appreciate this shoe. But if you're a collector and you've got a varied fashion wardrobe, with different colors then this is definitely one for you so it's not a very straightforward shoe in a sense then that's the front there i do love the front the front's just nice i like the laces because they're different they are a lot thinner and more rounder and i think that accentuates the tongue the tongue the tongue comes up more then you've got the braces on the front there i do love them they look very blingy they look very like early hip-hop days I like that. It's like, a, it's like a customized shoe. And that's the nice thing about them. And I will, I think, I think the color itself doesn't convey itself online. You know, and because it's not a Nike Dunk, I do wonder if it's going to be available with top tier zero stores, such as End or Nike stores. I don't think it will. Because it's an SB, it's probably going to be available either on sneakers or on the uh, skate shop websites, which is a shame because I think the color will look a lot better in real life as well. My mother, I know, should love to wear this. So who knows? It's, it was just a birthday. I might just surprise her and get her a pair. That's your top down view there, guys. And you got the gray as well as the yellow inside, which is nice. It ties in with everything else as well. Then you've also got the maize yellow on the back on the top section there, just where the ticks meet from either side. Beautiful. I also like the crown, but it looks like a crown from the inside as well. It looks beautiful. This shoe, 415. I just pray that the fit and finish of this shoe is, as it seems online, is top notch. Yeah, I like it. I shouldn't like it. It shouldn't make sense, but it does make sense. So kudos to Run the Jewels and Nike SB for this, or Nike, for this collaboration, guys. What do you guys think? Comment down below. Thanks for watching, guys. God bless. I'll see you soon.